In this video, let's see a numerical problem which is in succession to the previous problems which we have already seen on the topic of matrices. We already know the concept of order of a matrix and we have seen a variety of questions on the topic of order. This video is in succession to it. Let's see what the question has to say and let's get started with the solution. The question says, what is the number of possible matrices? What is the number of possible matrices of the order? The order is given to me as 2 by 3 with each entry or each element as 0, 1 or 2. So, I have a brief idea what the question says. Still, we will have to see it in detail. The matrix are actually denoted with the order first. The order is very important and the order is given to me as 2 by 3. That means there are only 2 rows but 3 columns. So, 3 columns into picture and 2 rows into picture. Now, when this happens, how many elements would be there? I already told you there are 6 elements. Why? Because m into n, the number of rows into columns, give me the number of elements. Otherwise also you can see 3 elements here and 3 elements below. But the story is not completed here. The story actually has a lot more depth to it. Because my question tells me that each entry can be either 0 or 1 or 2. So that means how many positions how many elements can be placed on this position? This is position number 1. This position can be filled by either 0 or 1 or 2. So it is either 0 will come here or 1 will come here or 2 will come here. Similarly, in the next position also, either 0 will come or 1 will come or 2 will come. Here also, either 0 or 1 or 2. And so on, the same story goes for here, these things also. Right? And we already know the concept of permutations and combinations that I have two rules. Fundamental laws of counting, you remember? Multiplication rule and addition rule. I need to fill all these six places. When I need to fill all these six places, I know that the first place and the second place and the third and the fourth and the fifth and the sixth. Since it deals with the word AND, so we will be having the multiplication law of counting, which we studied in class 11. So how many possibilities for position number 1? 3 possibilities because either 0 or 1 or 2. Position number 2 also 3 possibilities. Position number 3 also 3 possibilities to be filled. Position number 4 also 3 possibilities. Position number 5 also 3 possibilities. And position number 6, which is the last into consideration, also has 3 possibilities. Any 3 of these entries, any 3 of these numbers 0, 1, 2 can be here. So now, since it is AND, we use multiplication. Let's multiply. 3 3 is 9. 9 3 is 27. 27 3 is 81. 81 3 is 243, that is 243. And 243 into 3 is 729. So my answer for the number of possible matrices of the order 2 by 3 with each entry 0 or 1 or 2 is 729.